This video covers how to find the intersection of two linear lines, so where they cross over, uh, using our graphics display calculator. And I'll show you two different methods as to how to find the coordinate of the intersection. So looking at our example question here, we are asked to find the coordinates of the intersection of these two linear lines. You can see that these are the lines here. We have line one, the green line, line two, the orange line, and we want to find this point here, the coordinate of the intersection. Now doing this by hand algebraically would be somewhat challenging. We would need to do it using simultaneous equations, even uh, either using the substitution or elimination technique. However, I'm gonna show you how to find it on the graphics display calculator fairly quickly and easily. So let's go ahead and do the first method, which is using the solving simultaneous equations function on our calculator. Okay, so we start at an empty scratch pad and we go menu, number three, algebra, Number two, solve system of linear equations. Okay, how many equations do we have? Well, we only have two. Sometimes you may have three. It's either gonna be two or three, but most likely two. Then you enter your variables. Now, our equations do have X's and Y's. If yours had, say, A's and B's, you can delete these out uh, using your keyboard here and replace them with A's and B's and just with a comma between. But I'm not gonna change these because uh, our equations here do have X's and Y's. Okay, we then hit OK. Now we type our two equations in directly. So the first one is Y equals, set up a fraction, it's two on three, X plus two. So that's the first equation entered. We go down to the next line and we enter in the second equation. So Y equals negative X plus five and then we just simply hit enter. So we hit enter. Now that gives it in fraction form and that would be fine, but I'm gonna convert mine to a decimal. So control, enter. So it's 1.8, 3.2. So 1.8. Okay, so that right there is the coordinate of where these two linear lines pass through. So that's the first method. Let's now look at the second method on the calculator, which is using the graphing section. So we tab across to that, which is this um, icon here. And let's go ahead and enter our two linear lines. So yeah, the first one, which is uh, fx, uh, sorry, f1x, so the, the first function we're gonna enter. Let's just let that equal two. Uh, in the graphing section, we don't type y equals, we just type the right-hand side. So we have two on three x plus two, hit enter. Now in order to enter the second equation, we hit this tab button. Now we enter our second uh, linear line equation. So negative x plus five, and there's our second line there. Now to find the coordinates of the intersection, we use the analysis tools area of our calculator. So to, go, to find that, we go menu, number six, analyze graph, and we're going to choose number four, intersection. Now the calculator asks you to, to sort of give it direction as to where this intersection occurs, because if you have multiple lines, there could actually be multiple intersections. So when it asks for lower bound, you just drag your cursor just to the left of where the intersection occurs and then click. Or, or hit enter. And then for the upper bound is just to the right. So that's basically saying to the calculator, the, uh, the intersection occurs somewhere in this shaded region. Hit click there and there we have it. So there's the coordinates again, it matches up to the previous method. And that, it, that right there is the second method. So we have covered two different ways to find the coordinates of linear lines using our graphics display calculator.